five drinks to repair and heal your inflamed colon. Your colon is a long tube at the very end of your digestive system, which has the job of finishing digesting your food and turning it into stool. This is where water, electrolytes and some vitamins are absorbed through the walls of your intestine into your bloodstream. Unfortunately, the inner walls of the large bowel can often become inflamed and damaged, triggering problems like diverticulitis, inflammatory bowel disease, colitis, Crohn's, irritable bowel syndrome, chronic constipation and many other issues. But what causes this damage in the first place? Well, the most common cause of inflammation in the colon is eating too many grains, flour-based foods, vegetable oils and gluten, which can irritate the lining of the intestine. Antibiotic drugs, painkillers and other medications can also cause the friendly bacteria that lives in your colon to become pathogenic, causing an autoimmune reaction and inflammation. And also, over 65% of people have an intolerance to dairy, so when they consume milk, this can trigger a reaction in the colon causing damage to its walls. Along with generally just having an unhealthy lifestyle, stress, smoking, drinking alcohol, drugs or eating too many deep fried foods. In my other videos, I talk more about the underlying causes of digestive damage and how you can correct your diet. In this video, however, we will be exploring five very simple drinks that help to heal an inflamed colon by lowering the inflammation. Just my usual reminder, this video is for educational purposes only, so do speak to your doctor if you have any medical concerns. One of the best natural remedies for lowering inflammation in the colon and also treating ulcers is raw cabbage juice. Simply add fresh, organic purple or green cabbage to a blender or an electronic juicer. Strain the mixture and then drink 1 to 4 cups of this per day. Cabbage juice is loaded with glutamine and methylmethionine, also known as vitamin U. These are two powerful natural ingredients which have been shown in studies to help heal the lining of the colon for the treatment of ulcers and inflammation. Also, the vitamin C and the glutamine in this drink can restore the protective mucus layer in your gut to prevent toxins from leaking into your body and causing an autoimmune reaction. Number 2 is Bone Broth Bone broth is one of the richest natural sources of collagen, the material that's needed to form the lining of your colon and gastrointestinal tract. Our ancestors consumed this as a staple in their diet as it was made by boiling animal bones in the form of a stew, but this has fallen out of favour in the last 60 years, which may be the culprit for so much collagen loss. Instead of boiling up the bones at home, you can simply purchase a powdered bone broth made from fish or grass-fed beef bones and add this tasteless liquid to a glass of water or in a soup. It's rich in amino acids called proline, glutamine and arginine, which all help to seal the damaged areas of your gut lining and restore the integrity of your intestinal walls. This helps to lower inflammation in the colon and to prevent autoimmune diseases like psoriasis, arthritis, celiac disease, pernicious anemia, hypothyroidism, etc. If you're finding this information helpful so far, please hit the like button, subscribe and turn all notifications on to stay updated with my latest health and nutrition tips. Number 3 is also very powerful, apple cider vinegar and turmeric. Take a glass of water, add 1 tablespoon of raw and unfiltered apple cider vinegar and 1 quarter teaspoon of turmeric powder. Stir it well and drink it twice per day. 30 minutes before you eat a meal. Apple cider vinegar is made from fermented apple juice and it's rich in something called acetic acid. This feeds the cells in your colon with short chain fatty acids, helping to strengthen them and heal any pockets of damage in the walls of your intestine. Turmeric also contains curcumin, a powerful anti-inflammatory compound which can help to destroy harmful microbes that may be living in your digestive tract. This tonic is also one of the best drinks for overcoming acid reflux because it helps to restore the digestive juices called bile, enzymes and hydrochloride so that you can digest your foods properly. 
Note, if you have stomach ulcers, please avoid this drink until they are first healed as the acidity can irritate them. Number 4 is a rich source of chlorophyll, wheatgrass juice. One of the main problems for people with an inflamed colon is that they struggle to digest vegetables and fruits because of the high fibre content. However, we need certain phytonutrients and also chlorophyll from plants to help heal the lining of the gut and restore the cell walls from the inflammatory damage. So to overcome this issue, you can purchase raw Kamut wheatgrass juice powder from health food stores. This powder is made from the juice of the wheatgrass that has been dried very slowly using low heat to preserve its nutrients. Simply mix a teaspoon of this in a glass of water and drink every morning on an empty stomach to supercharge the healing process in your bowel. This is one of the richest sources of chlorophyll without the fibre, which can help to restore the mucus barrier in your gut and it also helps to secure the tight junctions in the cell wall of the colon to prevent toxins from leaking through into your body, causing leaky gut and autoimmune diseases. And finally we have number 5, which is kefir. As I previously mentioned, many people have a sensitivity to the lactose found in dairy products like milk, which can cause inflammation in your intestine. Kefir, however, is a fermented milk product which removes much of the lactose and makes it easier to digest for those with gut issues. Kefir is in fact one of the best natural foods and semi-liquids that you can consume to restore the trillions of friendly microbes that live in your large intestine. You can purchase kefir grains and make this yourself at home with milk or you can purchase it from health food stores, just make sure that it is unpasteurized as pasteurized products kills the friendly bacteria. The live probiotics in this drink are very helpful for those with any type of gut damage, especially ulcerative colitis, irritable bowel disease and Crohn's disease. It also helps to enhance the pumping action of your colon to help prevent constipation which may also be causing some of the inflammation inside your colon. As you can see, there are many fantastic remedies that you can try to help heal your inflamed colon and restore normal digestion. I recommend trying out one of these remedies daily for a period of 4 weeks and journal how your digestion improves over time. If it doesn't, then move on to find out which remedy has the most positive impact. These drinks work best when they're used in conjunction with a healthy lifestyle that's low in stress, junk foods and toxins. With that being said, let's now take a look at the 6 lifestyle tips that you can also use to support the healing of your colon. 1. Eliminate grains, gluten, vegetable oils, fruits, high fibre vegetables and legumes for the time being as these can irritate the gut. During this healing process, you can use the cabbage juice or the wheatgrass juice as a substitute for vegetables because the fibre may irritate your gut lining. 2. Eat lots of high quality proteins rich in amino acids like grass fed beef, bone broth stews, chicken soup along with some sautéed onions. The amino acids in these will help to restore the collagen in the lining of your colon and tighten up the cell line to prevent toxins from leaking into your blood. 3. Start taking 20,000 international units or 0.5 milligrams of vitamin D3 daily along with 200 micrograms of vitamin K2. People with gut damage usually have a vitamin D deficiency. This higher dosage is required to stimulate healing in the colon and to lower the inflammatory response from your immune system. 4. Cut out alcohol and stop smoking as much as possible where you can, as these deplete your antioxidants and vitamin C, which can cause scurvy in the colon where the toxins leak into your bloodstream causing autoimmune diseases. 5. Take a daily supplement of L-glutamine. This is available in a powdered form or a capsule and it helps to directly restore the protective mucus lining of the digestive tract. This works particularly well for ulcerative colitis and Crohn's disease. And finally 6. After your problem subsides, you can start to slowly introduce steamed vegetables back into your diet, but try to stay away from the inflammatory grains, gluten and vegetable oils as these will likely cause your problem to return. 
Now, to protect your colon long term, it's also very important to boost the amount of friendly bacteria that lives inside by eating probiotic and prebiotic rich foods. To learn about the top 8 probiotic rich foods in the world, go ahead and tap on this video on the screen now. Thank you so much for watching this video today, and as always, I wish you great health, wealth, and happiness.